Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to create a cartoon portrait logo on your mobile device. This works on iPhone and Android, and it's a totally free app. You could use this logo as your Instagram profile, for example, to really stand out on Instagram. And if it's your first time here, I make easy to follow social media and tech videos every single day, so please consider subscribing. Jump into the App Store or Google Play Store and look for PixArt Photo Editor. I already downloaded it. Let's go ahead and open it up here. And you could skip all the paid options. I'm gonna show you something that's totally free. Press the plus sign here on the bottom to create your first image. And then if you go all the way to the bottom, you should get color backgrounds. We're just gonna start with a white color background here. Next, let's go ahead and create a shape. So on the very bottom, these are all the different tools that you have. So if you slide through it, we're gonna slide and get to draw. Press draw, and then under draw, you'll have something that looks like shapes right there. Next to T, there's shapes. So here, I have a bunch of shapes to choose from. I'll just choose a circle here and opacity at full. A 255 fill and then I'll go ahead and press the check mark now I could go ahead and drag and create my circle here and I'll bring it somewhere in the middle of the page and before I press apply on top to finalize this look at the color box on the corner of the page on the bottom press that and fill a color that you want this is what's gonna be behind you so choose a color you want in this case I'll just choose a pink color here, press check. And before I apply, I could resize it still a little bit and make sure it looks okay. And now let me press apply on top. So now let's bring in our picture. So again, on the bottom, we need another tool. This time we're gonna choose a tool called add photo. Select that. And here you could either choose images that you have on your camera phone. You could access your camera here, take a picture of yourself or you could just choose one of these images that comes with the app. In the case of creating a logo with your image, you obviously don't want to use one of these stock images, but for this video, I'll choose one of these and press add on top. And then I'm gonna grab the bottom corner here, those arrows, and then just use my finger here to make this much bigger. About this size will work. And before I press apply, I wanna cut her out from the background or cut yourself out from the background as well. So on the very bottom, you see we're on opacity here, but then go over to the right and you will get to cutout. Select cutout. And if you just press the person icon here, you should automatically go ahead and highlight you red here. If not, you can manually do it with the other option and then go ahead and press save. And as you could see, she was cut off from the background. Now I could just bring her and you could either shrink her down here and put her somewhere like this, put yourself somewhere like this over the red dot behind you. And then once you're done, press apply. Next, we're gonna turn ourselves into a cartoon. So again, on the bottom, go all the way to effects. That's one of the first options here. And we're gonna do a couple of different effects. The first one is under artist. You see all those different text options on the bottom, artist. And then on top of that, there's oil painting. And it's gonna be pretty significant, but if you tap oil painting one more time, you'll get this amount slider. So you could go to zero, that's nothing, or 100 is too much. But somewhere in between there, maybe around 40 should do and we'll press apply on top. Now let's do one more here. Go back to effects. And this time, instead of artist, we wanna be under sketch. Now sketch has a first one, sketch one is free. Go ahead and select that. And it's gonna be a little bit offset, but if you press sketch, the square on the bottom one more time, it's gonna give you the options here. And we want to bring horizontal here to zero, so it does a perfect overlay. I like to make the lines a little bit bolder, so I'm gonna bring the lines all the way up. And I'm gonna choose my color here. I don't want white, I want black. So that's right next to white. And if the lines seem too much to you, you could go ahead and dial them back a little bit. So somewhere maybe around 31 here. And if I like that look here, I could press apply. And I usually do one last filter here. The one next to effects is called beauty. If you select that and you choose auto, it's gonna soften the face a little bit and make it a little bit more smooth. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that at 50. I'll press check mark on top and I'll apply it. And finally on the bottom, I'll go all the way to the right. There's something called shape mask. Go ahead and select that. And it's gonna let you create this overlay mask here. So opacity, I'm gonna turn it all the way up at hundred and then I'll bring this over her head and I'll increase the size. So it cuts off the bottom here a little bit and I'll place that right there. This is exactly what I want out of the logo and I'll Press apply on top and I'll press next. 
And now I could go directly to Instagram or save it to my photos. I'll save it to my photos. I could also go to Facebook, Snapchat, go to PixArt or even message this. So if I take this directly to Instagram, this is what it would look like. And I could go ahead and go to my profile and add it as my profile logo right there. And it's that simple to create a cartoon portrait logo using PixArt. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow social media and tech videos. And I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.